tell me why seventh grade was the worst year of your life or worst grade of your life. So I had my period Mm -hmm. and like I, it was just like there was so much happening in my body Yeah, that was, the way my middle school was set up was sixth, seventh, eighth grade. Uh Sixth grade, you were like in your own wing and then you had to like go out into the rest of the school for like choir or Spanish class or stuff. But you were like kind of a little protected in this little wing. And then I feel like I got to seventh grade and it was just like, all hell broke loose. Um, yeah, and, it's horrible. And I just was, I felt like I was bleeding everywhere. <laughs> like I just bled <laughs> constantly. Like I was always had to have a jacket to tie around my waist. Oh, that. Um, and there was definitely friend dynamic stuff of like. Cruelness. These were girls that I was really close with growing up. And now we're not going to be as close because yeah. like we're sort of on different academic paths. Yeah. Or I went to a magnet elementary school. And so when I got to middle school, most of my friends didn't go to the same middle school. So I had to like make all new Start friends alone. in sixth yeah. grade. Yeah. And so that was kind of um, difficult too. I lost a friend to suicide in seventh grade as mm. well. Oh. And so it just was a very intense, really intense, difficult, trying year. And none of us had the skills no. um, or maturity to be able to handle any of yeah. that. So it was like a lot of adult things happening to, even though you feel grown up, you're a child. 